Hello everyone, this is Dr. Sam and this is an ultrasound report example of varicose veins. You will learn how to write the findings and impression of the report in a patient with varicose veins. In this example, the patient is a 45-year-old male presenting with complaints of pain, swelling and visible varicosities along the course of the great saphenous vein in the right leg there is a history of prolonged standing at work and a family history of chronic venous insufficiency equipment used high resolution ultrasound system with doctor capability technique the examination was performed with the patient in both standing and reverse Trendelenburg positions to adequately assess venous reflux. A combination of grayscale, color doppler, and spectral doppler imaging techniques was utilized to evaluate the deep and superficial venous systems of the right lower extremity, focusing on the great saphenous vein. The great saphenous vein is another name for the long saphenous vein. Then you can write the findings. These are the findings of the great saphenous vein. The GSV is dilated with a maximum diameter of 7.5 millimeters. The normal measurement is below 3 millimeters. There is evidence of valvular incompetence at the saphenofemoral junction and along multiple points of the GSV characterized by reflux lasting more than 0.5 seconds during Valsalva maneuver and with distal compression. Deep venous system. There is no evidence of deep venous thrombosis. The deep veins show normal physicity with respiration and competent valves. Perforator veins. Incompetent perforator veins with a diameter greater than 3.5 millimeters were noted in the medial aspect of the cough showing reflux. Other superficial veins. The small saphenous vein is normal in caliber with competent valves. Then you can write the impression. Primary varicose veins of the right lower extremity secondary to great saphenous vein incompetence with significant reflux at the saphenofemoral junction and along the vein. Incompetent perforator veins contributing to venous hypertension and varicose vein formation in the medial cough. No evidence of deep venous thrombosis. You can write the recommendations after the impression which includes further advice and referrals. Consideration for minimally invasive endovenous therapy such as endovenous laser ablation or radiofrequency ablation targeting the incompetent GSV and perforator veins. Compression therapy to manage symptoms and prevent progression of chronic venous disease. Follow up ultrasound in 6 months to assess treatment efficacy and venous hemodynamics post-intervention.